We're here at H-E-L-N-L Stadium in Gehenna, Texas. Owner GM and coach Scary Clones wants his newly completed art installation to get the crowd pumped. But most are just wondering why a bunch of naked painted orcs are gyrating in the lobby. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Baltimore Razors take on the Malice Hellboys. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If you like your cocktail cold, your soup hot, and your steak still mooing, then you're going to love seeing mutants knock cold, their brains turned into hot lava soup, and their bodies strewn about the field, lying still and barely moving. MFL game day is on the air. Wow, you just made me hungry, Grim. I'm going to go get some of extra crispy mutant finger strips. Hey, get me a full slab of broken mutant ribs while you're there. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot one. What are you trying to impress your third fan base to bring him into the game? And of course, Junior, they got great disposable income. And good one. Second down in a very lot. Hot, hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. He blasted and picks up seven yards right there. Third down and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot eight. He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stop all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection too. Uh, now that is weird side effects, Bricks. And he finds open space. He's running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch! And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. Second down and five. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Eight. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. First down and five. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stomped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, at the all-you-can-eat buffets? They're not as literal as you'd think. Second down and two. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot eight. Four. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. He picks up a two. And he lines up for the field goal attempt, trying to ignore the defensive threats of murder. Hey. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just give him the. And the ref just called a bullshit penalty. Ballsy, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. <laughs> First. 
For a kick this far, you just got to kick it as hard as you can, partner. And aim. It's really important from this distance. It's probably a smart idea. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Oh, with the punishing hit. <laughs> and it's first and ten. for the first down. And it's first and ten. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep, third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It's good. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sits up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. First and ten. Right. Right. One. Right. And that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. You know, they're all in politics, apparently. Second and three. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Shoveled his feet so well on that play. He should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Let me tell you, getting shot is no joke. I used to wear triple wool socks, slide around on a shed carpet for eight hours so I could shock my younger brother. I went to change the TV channel. And we've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end. Finally. And it's first and ten. Oh, mama! He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. Second and three. and he picks up a new set of downs. First down and nine. And he rumbles into the end zone for the score. I hope he's not going to dance now.
You know, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. for nine yards. And that'll bring up second and one. And he's running like a move. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. First down. And it's first and ten. Second down and a lot. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. I personally think that the ginormous guy is comp- Oh, and he took a leap and had the ball knocked out. Fumble! He's got a case of fumbleitis. <laughs> and that'll be second and eight to go. Mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And that'll bring up second and one. First down. And the running game opens up for them and allows the passing game to be more of a threat. Gotta keep them guessing. And it's first and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Second down and seven. He 
is not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. And it's first and ten. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self-doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. Hey, man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make a pay. First and ten. Look out! That's an all-out attack on the. <laughs> oh wow! If you're a defender, the only good QB is a dead one, Bricks. Ah, he must be pretty good then, because he is dead. And it's first and ten. First down to keep the drive alive. They stop the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. That's a six-yard gain. Well, that's two timeouts burned, and you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim, but it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. Nicely done for a first down. And they take their last time out. It's between them and the clock now, Grim. Well, and the defense, too. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. Put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. <laughs> Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. the ball into the defense picking up seven they stop the clock but they only have one timeout left uh, that's okay Grim they can have mine that's uh that's nice bricks but our timeouts are for our sponsors and we need money more than they do hit that line the way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room good and hot First down. The quarterback just used his final timeout. Let's see what they come up with on the next play. 
And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Prince Matt's stupsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. And then Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they're hitting, but he sure has a good set of hands. It's a close battle as the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. Third quarter about to begin here, and these guys are locked in a nearly dead heat. I was locked in a dead heat under the covers last night when Bricks started farting like a 4th of July fireworks finale. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. needs a miracle. <laughs> Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Love the sound of bones snapping and cracking. I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. And the rumor is going crazy fast. Look at the pass he's taking a field. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And that'll be second down and four. a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Third down and a pussy here. And that is called for a first down. First and four. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. They need to call an attack ref dirty trick and stop this, or they're going to lose. Not like they need any help with that, though, Brad. These guys are doing fine by themselves. They're back 
up here on first. And the offense jumps on sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. First down and forever. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down in a mile. And that was a huge run right there. Hey, speaking of huge runs, Bricks, why don't you put a cork in that gravy maker of yours, huh? Hey, I'm dying up here. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Great chance for a big game. But still not enough for a first. Even I'm frustrated, and I'm a team agnostic. The defense gets the ball back. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. He had it for a second there. Second down and ten. He dropped it, you putts. Third down and ten. <laughs> Man, this coach must have played too many video games. You got to punt it here. Come on. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly fast. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. for a yard. That's the end of the third quarter. This game is going to come down to the wire. Second down and nine. like a huge 
human cannonball. First down. Yeah, my next door neighbor was a human cannonball, Grim. He drowned in his pool. And it's first and ten. It looks like the defense handed our shrinking pills. Uh, and he picks up two yards on the catch. And that'll be second and eight to go. Defense gives up five yards on that pass play. Third and two. And the defense goes for the juggler. And you know, in some leagues, you aren't even allowed to touch the QB. In the MFL, they have plays just for killing them. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. First down and three. The defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder ball. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. And here comes the extra point attempt. The kick is good. Um, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. And it's first and ten. Oh, what a sack there. I heard this guy likes to play with soft balls. He's going to play with crushed balls from here on out. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Wow, he took like a thousand volts of shot there. They did that to my Aunt Lizzie because she thought she was the reincarnation of Lizzie Ward and the Ant Spider. Did the shot treatment work? Well, after she killed four of the doctors and zapped her, they never bothered her again. So yeah, I, I guess it worked for her. Second down and more defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. And it's first and ten. First and ten. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And that'll bring up second and one. for the touchdown.
They're going for two points. And he runs it in for an easy two points. The momentum in this game may be shifting. Wow, those are just my balls. Hey, thanks for sharing, Bricks. right back up and fight. And what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Oh, with a punishing hit. And it's first and ten. It's a nice catch for five yards. Second down and five. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. That's a nice gain of about seven yards on that run. <laughs> Second and three. two-minute warning sounds they'll have to regroup during this timeout third down and nine no he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball what a pick ahead get the ball asshole hey asshole up here talking to you And that punter gets paid way too much to kick like that. They just let that one drop and play it safe, and the defense says, we'll take it. And it's first and ten. The defense better look out. The offense called the Beast Boost Dirty Trick. scared of this guy, Bricks, and they have every right to be. Yeah, he's a murderer! Under two minutes, a timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're gonna hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. And the offense quickly calls their second timeout. That's how you do it. And that'll bring up second and one. Just some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Well, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. Quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too. Second down and ten. Nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. 
And I think his dance in his band, you should have been here in the old days. He used to mark their territory the old fashioned way. But they agreed to dial it down to uh, interpretive dance. I took an interpretive dance class with a werewolf on Grim. He damn near clawed my face off. Well, that was before the class even started. And these guys think kicking is for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Grim. Yeah, bigger than yours. Two-point plays are high risk, high reward. And it just didn't pay off. And now they're both screwed and stupid. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. are defeated today. They battled hard, but didn't have enough to get it done. They choked like a bunch of banana choking chimp chumps choking on a bag of chimp dicks. Did you just say choking on a bag of chimp dicks? Yeah. God, that was beautiful. Hey, you see that little lady? No, you didn't. You know why? That was bad. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Heart Corporation. They get it right every up.